guys, welcome back to this edition of Let's Play. I'm Anthony, and we're back with Resident Evil Zero. And um, as I'm recording this, it's February 5th, which is my third year anniversary on YouTube. You probably won't be seeing this on February 5th, of course, but just while I'm recording, I just figured I'd say it because it, you know, kind of brings me back to 2010 and even before because I was doing this before 2010 as well. But this channel has grown so thank you for everybody who's keep coming by but anyway back to reality in here um basically we're billy again rebecca died last time um we're not rebecca died but we died trying to save rebecca last time basically i fucked up i'm not supposed to go in the torture chamber which is where i got fucked up by monkeys i'm supposed to go in the room in between the stuff and get the handgun ammo and leave because i fucked up last time and I have to go through the steam room and such to save Rebecca. Uh, the monkeys might be a bit of a challenge, but we're going to try to kill as much as we can because running away from these guys seem to be impossible. It's They're like the midget fuckers of Zero, so... Uh, but they might as well just be called fucked up monkeys. And I don't, I don't necessarily think that they're, they're, I mean, two hits, they're usually dead with a grenade launcher. I mean, to me, I think that's a lot. Uh, maybe, you know, I, I don't know. So basically what we're trying to do is, I, kn I know where to go, but we're going to go through here, get the ammo, and leave. Uh, just so we don't miss out. I, I, I could just kind of leave the ammo. I don't necessarily have to uh, go and grab it now. But I think it's kind of more necessary for me to just grab it and leave. I think there's, there's shotgun shells in here too. Um, but I, my shotgun is in the main hall right now. It's laying on the floor, so we can always come back and get get it later. And plus, you know, rather have the grenade launcher right now. But uh, I, I don't know the best method towards the monkeys. Um, but I'm going to guess that the shotgun takes as long as the uh, grenade launcher. Uh, so we're going to continue now, and uh, we have to go on the west side, I believe. We have to go nuts the door and um, yeah so I I think uh, I don't know how many monkeys are where she is that's the, I think that's the problem though because I don't have any health I mean I can look at what I yeah like I don't that's what I might do though just for uh, might just leave my leave off my ink ribbon here for now in case we need to pick up something because I don't feel comfortable with a uh, fucking uh, with a with all open space. You know, every I mean, not uh, a non-open space because you never know if you have to pick up something. Uh, so I'm not sure. Um, I'd appreciate an herb considering I'm on caution, but I don't know. Whoa, he's waking up. Oh fuck. Okay. <laughs> I think this is the way. I don't remember because when we did the generator. Yeah, I think this is it. Yeah, because when Rebecca hit the generator, the steam right here went away. Right here, so. Oh, awesome herbs. Fuck yeah. Alright, awesome. What I'll probably do is, well, I could have just used it when I picked it up, but I'll use that. I'll take one with me. He can't mix herbs, so that I, even if I had two slots, it would be impossible. Oh, look at that. Red and blue herbs or whatever. Rebecca will probably pick them up. Uh, but we gotta worry about saving. Okay, so I have four rounds. It probably takes two round a monkey, uh, and you got six flame rounds, which are the napalm grenades, I should say. Well, I don't know how well they work, but the handgun is trash against these guys. I mean, seriously, you might as well just use the fucking fork to try to hit them because it doesn't work. Oh fuck. Oh motherfucker. <sighs> Pissed me off so fucking much. Hang in there, Billy. You're going on fine right now. Fucking assholes. I'm not even gonna let them fucking move. Okay. Whoa! Fuck you.
Don't know where Rebecca is. What the hell is this? More handgun ammo. That's cool to stock up. Um, I don't know where she is. I don't want to run into more monkeys. That's th that's like the last thing I want to actually run into. Oh. Fucker. Go through here. I, I, like I said, I don't know where she is. At the finder. Um. Something tells me she's not in here. I'm just gonna take a guess and say that she isn't in that door. We have to find her, because I swear to God, if she just falls and dies and I have to do all this again, I'm gonna be very upset. This looks like a door that would have something important behind it, I think. It looks like it. Oh, what the fuck, man. Keep... Don't, like... What the fuck? Doesn't even look like if... What the fuck? This is gonna be a confusing one, I can tell. I can just tell already. What the fuck? I honestly don't think I'm even supposed to be here. <laughs> honestly. I think I just went through the wrong door. Which is unfortunate because if she dies, like I said, I have to redo all of this again, which isn't going to be very fun. And I won't even record it at that point because then I just get repetitive, I think. Okay. I guess I'm not supposed to be here. I don't even know if they showed it on the map. I don't think they did. I, I, I probably wouldn't remember even if they did. I honestly don't know. Uh, I think we're gonna try to go... No, turn around. Nice, okay. Here. I think this is where we have to go. I'm gonna try to... Have to this is the second door I could try, so... <laughs> Wouldn't exactly know. Uh, is this it? Yes. Rebecca! Uh, uh, Hang on. I'll pull you up. Thank you. Don't mention it. Just keeping my word. We promise to cooperate with each other. Remember? This is Rebecca, over. Rebecca, this is Enrico. Have you managed to locate Cohen yet? Over. Rebecca, answer me. No, sir. I have not found him yet. I'll continue to search for him. Over. Rebecca. My first mission, and I've already disobeyed orders. So much for my great law enforcement career. Oh well, I probably won't live long enough to worry about it. Billy, I just need to know. I need to know the truth. Did you kill 23 people? I'm not going to judge you. I just want to know the truth. It was around this time last year. Our unit was ordered to Africa to intervene in a civil war. Our mission was to raid a hideout of some guerrilla forces located deep inside the jungle. But the hideout was far away from our entry point. Some 
died from the heat. Others were killed by the enemy. In the end, only four of us survived. Only, there was no guerrilla hideout. What do you mean? The idiots in charge had us operating based on wrong information. But we couldn't just go back home empty-handed, oh no. Our leader ordered us to attack an innocent village. Get rid of them! Kill them all! Please, sir! Cease fire immediately! Shut up! Ugh. Did you execute those innocent people? Forget about it. Doesn't matter anymore. That was then, this is now. Besides, you said you wouldn't judge me. I'm not judging you, but it does matter. Look, now my people think you killed those MPs in the van, but I don't think you did. It was those zombie dogs, right? When they attacked the van, you were able to escape. Isn't that right? You don't get it. I've only got two choices left. Either report to the Marines and serve out my sentence, or keep on running for as long as I can. That's all. Well, as you saw, there's obviously a, um, some backstory on, um, on Billy. Um, yeah, so very interesting. I really like what they did with, the, with him and, and, and everything else. This is cool. Alright, so awesome. We get a typewriter and uh, a little save, which makes sense. You can never save too many times, as I always say. Mm hmm. Okay. Well, now things. This is where the fun begins because. Um, I'm gonna give this to fucking Rebecca because she kind of needs it more than I do. At least Billy can stay on clutch and for a little bit longer. Oh wait, no, I should have. I gotta change and exchange with her. Here you go, and we are gonna change her. I'm recording audio.